when repairing my vehicle my friend asked me to get some audio amplifier for his garage to have some beats around when doing repairs or just uh, having a beer or couple I'll give a try to this uh, well-known cheap D-class amp from China featuring TDA7498 cheap I already soldiered it on off on volume knob and audio input port this amp is promising uh, two channel and 100 watts per channel at uh, power supply maximum 36 volts I will use this cheap switching power supply 24 volts and 4 amps and by looking at the data sheet of the T-class amp chip at the load of 8 ohms and by using power supply of uh, 24 volts I will get around 45 watts per channel output but that depends well I also added uh, this cheap little voometer this add a nice little detail to the project and DC DC step down converter for the voometer 24 volts to 12 volts and everything I will put in this plastic box cheap little plastic box I already drilled holes for audio input volume knob and voometer on off button is glued already and LED for 24 volts and neon light for the mains everything goes inside cables are already soldered and isolated it's a hot shrinking tube <clears throat> at the bottom side there is speaker terminals and the main port so a cheap little interesting project for the spare time okay we'll put everything inside and see how it works no need for use for cooler at uh, full load at uh, 24 uh, volts uh, they are not getting hot, just a little bit uh, warm <clears throat> ok as this box is not very well made plastic and cheap to keep in place the front and bottom two component epoxy glue is used extensively to keep everything very nice and tight also well switches lights and terminals are screwed and glue the boards will be secured to the housing by applying these two component epoxy glue to the base of the screw a lot of glue if I ever will need to remove the board I will just unscrew the top screw this screw set plastic screw set is actually very handy when messing around with various PCB boards well I'll just leave it for 24 hours and then we'll glue this guy and this one using hot air gun to shrink some isolation tube
as the screws do not hold the top of the casing reliable and one of the screw even came bent a little bit I decided to apply a glue to the top of the casing and glue it together forever it will not be possible to open it in case of need of servicing but it will be like the most of stuff that come from China no way to open it without breaking it the supply here and here and there a little bit and screw it together let's do a final test before I package this and give it to my friend let's connect AC mains let's connect speakers the left speaker okay let's connect some audio source Turn on this beast. Oops, I can hear some interference in the speakers, some small amount. Oh. Okay, let's turn on audio. Some old club hits from La Roca have some power I think for the purpose is built for for the some beats in garage it will be fine I just wonder what the interference is coming out let's measure it disconnect the speakers and connect this small wire here Connect the oscilloscope probe. We'll get ground point from the this line in connector. Grounding point. Okay, so it's now off. Let's see. Warming up, okay, so select uh, measure, frequency, and peak to peak, okay, let's turn this on, as I'm turning on, there is some 500 hertz noise, 2.5 volts peak to peak as I'm increasing volume the peak to peak amplitude also increases yep some noise coming out but it's barely soundable soundable I think uh, for the purpose this amplifier is built to have some beats in garage it's pretty fine
it will come with full set of accessories power cord speaker cables and line-in cable okay let's package and give it to my friend hey <laughs> here you go <laughs> Uh, this complex. Mazinč, ne? Pobjegl. Al, če je to smuzovitis. Ja. Smuzi, ali preš kam kortic. Ja, 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 ja. we will connect this and uh, see how it works. More repair of the speaker. The smaller one is a little bit damaged, and we will replace it with this one. We will do some soldering work here. The filter and wire. The wire one leg is broken, so we will soldier it. Light on fix. Start with the, this one. Okay, and uh, let's soldier this one. Oops. We are in the local hood, in the garage, and everything is set up, and that's how it sounds finally.
conversion, more powerful external input, Bluetooth, USB, radio, LCD screen, and better quality, and some better speakers.